Hi, this is Tariq Khatib, designer of Alfahas Configuration Auditor, and in this video, we'll talk about source routing. Let us first examine normal behavior. Host A is trying to send a packet to host B. Host A would send the packet first to router 1. Router 1 would look up its routing table, send the packet to R2. R2 would again look up its routing table, send the packet to R3, to R6, and all the way to host B. Source routing is an IP option that allows host A to specify the path the packet will take. For example, in this path, the packet would traverse through R4, R5, and R6 instead of going through R2, R3, and R6. So our path is going through here instead of going through here. There are two options when it comes to source routing. The first option is loose source routing. Loose source routing allows the packet to find a way to the next hop. For example, in this route, host A, R2, R5, host B, the packet starts at host A, looks for a path to R2, traverse the network through intermediate node R1 to R2, the next hop is R5, looks for a path from R2 to R5, traverse the network through intermediate node uh, R4 to R5, R5 through intermediate node R6 to host B. The other option in source routing is strict source routing. Strict source routing forces the packet to traverse the network one hop at a time without passing through any intermediate nodes. For example, the route R1, R2, R4 means that the packet will have to go through R1, then R2, then R4 without traversing any intermediate nodes. For example, if we remove R2 from this path R1, R4, the packet cannot go directly from R1 to R4 without traversing any intermediate uh, nodes which are R2. So the packet would be dropped at R1. So in this path, our path is R1, R2, R4, R5, R6 and all the way to host B. Let's now see how hackers can use source routing to spoof IP addresses. First, let's assume that host B only allows host A to access a certain resource. If the hacker uses A's IP address to access that resource, all replies from host B would go to host A. However, if the hacker uses source routing and uses, for example, this route, host A, hacker, host B, host B would reply and send all the packets to the hacker. So the packets would go from the hacker to host B, back to the hacker, and to host A. Naturally, the hacker can filter packets going to host A and limiting packets from the hacker to host B and back to the hacker. In this video, we learned how source routing works and how it can be used to spoof IP addresses. To learn how to turn off uh, source routing on your devices, please visit us at alfahis.com.